lighting on this? Is it just dark in here? I feel like I still have this left on auto. Oh, as I should. <sighs> yeah, no, you didn't. I'm saying I might have. Mm -hmm. That was the wine and cheese all over again. Where it was like the day before I'd lowered the brightness and then forgot about it. Any hoozle. Oh, God, I'm red in the face and pale in the torso. And this angle is still weird. This is going to be the longest shittiest. I've been drinking, everybody. This is a drunk vlog. Um, running every day. Day 26. I've got Jimmy Neutron hair. Um, my streak remains unbroken. Today was almost the day that I let it go. I woke up and had coffee and beer and I was going to go for a run and then pop into work and touch base with the dudes and just try and stay caught up on on the shit that we're working on. And I had my coffee, gonna go for my run, phone was dead. In the time that my phone was charging, drank some more, then we decided we would go out and do stuff, uh, primarily return our empties, which we didn't end up doing. So I was like, okay, my phone will charge in the car, then I'll run when we get back. If you watch both of my YouTube channels, you will see the the haul that we we did with our, our liquor store purchases uh, with our extremely well stocked bar and our, our our only shared hobby of um, buying exotic liquors and making cocktails um, this is what has replaced the bookstore yes this has very much replaced the bookstore uh, especially since I'm drinking 96 times as much as I'm reading. And with the lockdown over, I guarantee I'm going to find more time to read. Because I didn't read at all during the lockdown. I played video games, I watched TV, I spent hours on Twitter. I was desperate to be distracted, but I always felt like I was busy and worried. So now in my free time, I imagine I will calm down and begin reading again. Um, so anyways, we went out and did stuff. And I got plowed. Like, I, I drank, let's call it several beers and shots. And then we got home and did our, um, our new additions to the bar video, and I drank a lot more, including some absinthe. So I was just tanked up. And I was like, I need to eat something. And I was like, finally, you know what? I'm just going to go for a rip right now before I eat, because I won't do it after I eat. I'll feel terrible if I run after I eat while drunk. But I'll just go for a quick rip and then eat. That's what I did. I'm drinking again. I cooked eggs like an hour ago that are sitting in a pan. But, as I said, my streak is unbroken. Still got my running today. And I ran 8K. Because for all of this rest week, I've been just running as much as I feel like and making sure to come back um, before I'm tired. Like, I, I want to I wanna run for the love of it this week. That's the goal. Never push it and always come back before I feel like stopping. And at first, when I went out on my run... Um, I did a little exploring and ran down some alleys and stuff that I hadn't been down before. And then I thought, I just fell into this routine of this old route that I've, I've even shown on the channel before, where I ran to CrossFit Curry Barracks. I did a loop around that and came back, and it was really nice. It was nostalgic. Uh, I always mention in vlogs what Livia is doing, and Liv just finished tattooing another orange. Nope, no light. There's a silhouette of an orange. Can't see whatsoever that that's... So the blackout orange. 
This is the longest dumbest vlog ever. This is Olivia's tattooed orange. You can, uh, by the way, if you're practicing tattooing, you can tattoo various melons. Honeydew is recommended because of its size. It looks very much like, you know, a high school notebook. Not, not like a desk in detention, which, you know, some things look like. That looks like, you know, a good kid's notebook. Not a bad kid's notebook. Uh, okay, I'm gonna wrap this vlog up. Um, there's also three unpublished vlogs on the camera, as well as that last video, any hoozle. Remember that we should fight cyclists. They travel in flocks. They have to wear helmets. Children can keep up with them. It's just terrible. They're the worst. Fight cyclists.